So my niece tells me her cheer squad won a state championship. I said, well, that's great, Savannah. She said, no, Uncle Jamie, you don't understand. This is our 15th time. I said, 15 state titles? Yep. With the same coach? Yep. I have to meet Pasadena's dynasty queen. Winning does not get old. We start from day one building a culture of teamwork and family. 17 years coaching, 15 state championships. Guys, we just won states 15 times. Like, this is insane. Coach Lisa Elliott stares at the banners hanging from the rafters at Chesapeake High. It's pretty amazing. Like, there's so many awesome things about it. Like, I have four daughters and they all cheered here. Of course they won states, but Lisa will always remember her first. It was surreal. Like, that's one that you never forget, right? Well, you don't forget any of them, but... But the pressure to perform and for a team expected to win and does, that's a great coach. And there's a lot of pressure on them because they have set the bar so high for their program. A program she entered as a freshman, knew nothing about cheer, still has the sweater and the letter and the one word that she has learned. Patience. <laughs> I have learned teamwork and hard dedication and to be committed. I've learned that there's a lot to me. What does this team mean to you? Um, it means a lot. They're my family. Assistant Coach Joe, tell us it's so. Lisa is definitely the heart and soul of the program. No rah rah is alike. Always tell them cheerleading is not going to pay your bills and raise your kids someday, but your education certainly will. And for the Cougars, it's always wait until next year. Obviously, the goal is always to keep winning, right? But it's also building like really strong young women um, and having them take all this in, make it be so surreal, and know that like every single time we go for another one, it's just going to keep getting harder and we just have to do all the right stuff. Thank you, Savannah.